Uh, sir, about the you have coined a uh, term Zs. Uh, can you explain on that? Why should uh, we call that? The age, it is a acquired immune deficiency syndrome. <coughs> but that is uh, due to somatic mutations of this virus. Now, when it uh, comes into children, the terms I use. It's a new term which has not been given till now by scientists. This is called genetically immune deficiency syndrome called genes. That is the way I'm going to write in the book. And uh, this is called germline mutation. It's very dangerous mutation. And uh, not been detected by usual laboratory conditions or tests. Everybody has to do the microRNA profiling or uh, the mapping. Where this, uh, and secondly, most than the germline mutation is very difficult to treat and cure. Okay. Except the, our Barua, Barua combat genes that we are using at the moment, only five children, and they have been before the treatment, we do the mapping. After the treatment, we do the mapping. See, that is our microRNA, which are detrimental, is gone. And also, along with virus, are gone. The genes uh, is such that it's called, as I said, in 10 years' time, that uh, entire planet will be infected and destruction of the human race will begin. And uh, now it is too many uh, the uh, uh, loophole or this um, negative uh, the what to call the uh, the results we are getting it seventy percent of the now is more than that even some are recorded some are not recorded some are known some are not known so unknown and unrecorded is the individuals are more than recorded than uh, known persons so therefore. I really appeal to uh, everyone through the media that they should, this is the information that going, I'm giving, that they should take care. But how they will take care? Not possible. Not possible. Because they do not know who is infected, who is not infected. Nobody knows. Even I do not know. Until and unless I do the tests. So the test is a compulsory and the treatment with Borua combat genes is a and test, you say that it should be a genomic test. Yeah. It is a genomic test because the genes that we are seeing, unless you see the microRNA, which is a detrimental, which is being used by the virus, because they are, why microRNA? Why not messenger RNA? The microRNA is the regulator of the entire genome, human genome. That's why they go there. And they, what they do, they, rather in uh, lemon term, it is infected. The, the detrimental, they make the detrimental, then they have got a target genes, target genes become mutated, and detrimental mutations. Then they go to translation process. The translation process where immune system is destroyed, and they stop the messenger RNA, so that messenger RNA cannot uh, synthesize the beneficial protein and to make you better. But in fact, they they allow to synthesize the detrimental protein and the disease goes on and ultimately the human, the individual dies. But that is, that is very tragic because ultimately they, all of them, they die of encephalitis, which is the dreaded conditions. The patient gets coma and when they are in coma, their urine, their feces are all in uh, everywhere and they, their relatives, they don't put, uh, touch them, they don't go near them, even doctors and nurses also, uh, they hate them. So the death is absolutely miserable and sufferings are too long.